Dear Diary, I know I ask for this a lot, but I really, really just want a fuzzy little puppy. I proved to mama that I could take care of Planty and he's grown so much. I just don't understand why she won't give me a chance. Okay, calm down. I could be responsible when I try my best and that is what I plan to do. Hey you, your room looks nice and clean. Please make sure it stays that way. It is, I'm just showing you just how responsible I could be. Well, I must say I have seen some great improvements in you. Well, I am growing up and I just want to make sure that I am my best self daily. Oh, really? I like to hear that. Did you just bark? Oh. <laughs> the answer is no. We are not getting you a puppy. I, I know that. I wasn't even going to ask because I plan to actually get my own puppy in like 10, 12, maybe 15 years because time flies like you always say. Sure seems like it's going slow to me. It sure does fly, and you can do just that, so you can take care of him fully. Now, I'll catch you later. I'm going to take a nap. Hey, diary. It's me again. Did you hear that? Probably not because you don't have ears, but mama's still not willing to get me a puppy. I think it's best I take matters into my own hands. I'll talk to you soon. I see that you're always in the yard and you just need somebody to love you and that somebody is me. Come here. Come here. Come on. Okay. Okay, I got you. Okay, I'm sorry I have to do this, but I just have to cover your mouth for a second, okay? Until we get to your new home. Okay, let's go. I guess I should introduce myself. I'm Coco, and you are? Let's call you Dioji. Yes, that's the perfect fit. Oh, you're so calm and sweet. This is gonna be so easy. I just have to prove to mama that I'm responsible, and I promise she's gonna let us keep you. Oh, you're so cute. Oh, look, I wanna introduce you to somebody. This is my doggy. I got him a long time ago, and I said one day I'll have a dog just like him. And now I have you. Oh, wait. You're doing a lot of moving. Hold on. No, no, you can't do that, D.O.G. Sit down. I'm trying to prove that I'm responsible, remember? <laughs> Saying that makes sense. 
Oops. Oops is correct. And this room is a disaster. D.O.G. did it. No, Coco did it because Coco brought a dog in the house. Fix your face and take the dog back now. Oh, so we can't keep him? No, absolutely not. Oh, well, D.O.G., I guess our time is up. And if you don't hurry up and take him back, you'll be on punishment for a year. Well, D.O.G., your time is up. You gots to go take all your stuff and out you go. Out that door. Now, now, Coco, you know that's a no-no. Every time we turn our heads, you're always into trouble. With pretty big tails and a smile that makes us giggle. What can we say? That's just Coco being Coco. Now, now, Coco, you know that's a no-no. Every time we turn our heads, you're always into trouble. With pretty... Well, D.O.G., I guess your time is up. Get all your stuff. Take all your stuff, you gots to go. The dough is over there. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> now, now, Coco, you know that's a no-no. Every time we turn our heads, you're always into trouble. With pretty big tails and a smile that makes us giggle. What can we say? That's just Coco being Coco. <laughs> Ever thought about feeding the plant, too? Well, I asked us he wants some, but he doesn't respond, so I just figured he's good. <laughs> really, Coco? Seriously, plants need water, sun, and love. Oh, well, I guess I could share my water with him sometime. Mm -hmm. Ma Mama, is it true that plants like when you talk to them? Well, yes, actually, that is true. Plants like when we speak to them nicely and not yell at them. It has to do with the low levels of vibrations in our voices. Oh. I'm in love with you. Am I low enough, Mama? You said me free. Okay. I love you. You love me. Because you're my plenty. My plenty. It's been two years and three months since I've proven that I'm responsible enough to have a puppy. <laughs> Mama says that it's a lot to handle, but it can't be that bad, right? <laughs> what has you smiling from ear to ear? Oh, nothing. It's clearly something. Well, since you asked, I'm just really proud of myself. These last few years, I've really matured, learned some responsibility, and even learned how to be ready for even more bigger responsibilities. Oh, really? And how's that? Well, to start, I wake up really early. That's to ask me for breakfast. Oh. Well, you know what they say, the early bird gets the worm. Well, I pick up my toys. Um, half your toys. Half. The rest you stuff in a corner and act like I don't know. Oh, well, it looks clean when I'm done. I mean, I brush my teeth without you asking. You know, I do have to give you that one. You've been brushing your teeth morning and night. Yeah, and you know, I will forever since realizing Grammy wears dentures from barely brushing hers. Coco, she did. Well, sometimes. Look, she just started getting older. Give Grammy a break. Okay, okay. Well, the main responsibility that I have proven to achieve is growing plenty. He's doing great. I'm pretty sure that plant is dead. No, it's not. Coco, you can't even take care of yourself. Let alone a plant. I'm, I, I'm sorry, but this was an A and B conversation, so you could see your way out. Uh, out stop it. Way. Stop it. That's inappropriate, so stop. Who is teaching you that stuff? They said it at school. Well, don't repeat it, especially to your sister. I, I apologize, Aubrey. It's over. Now, wait, let's give Coco a chance. You know, now that I think about it, I haven't even seen that plant around. Well, that's because I was trying to show everybody that I could be responsible and help Planty grow healthy and strong. I gotta see this. <laughs> okay, let's see. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, close your eyes. Okay, let's see. Mama and Ari, plenty, plenty, Mama and Ari. Coco, you grew that? Yep. I guess she has grown a bit. <laughs> a lot of it. I've grown so much that I've proven that I'm responsible for even bigger responsibilities. And what's that? <laughs> what are you saying? Speak up, I can't hear you. <laughs> A dog and a plant are not the same. And then one minute you want the dog and the next you don't. Please, Mama, a doggy will play with me. Ari and Rhea, they're 
too big now. They never want to play. <sighs> Here comes the guest room. Oh, I'm serious. Every time I ask them to play, they say they're busy. Well, Coco, I mean, they're just a little older than you. That's all. So I can get a puppy? Yes. Really? Mm-hmm. Yes. A toy puppy. We'll go pick one out at the store. Now, now, Coco, you know that's a no-no. Every time we turn our heads, you're always into trouble with pretty pigs.